Hello everybody, this is JDB. In this video, we're going to talk about Redbubble and the truth about it. There are many videos on YouTube telling you you can make lots of money with Redbubble. Now, part of that is true, depends what you're doing. But most of it, it's not. It takes a lot of time, a lot of effort, and a lot of work to get this stuff working. So, I have two Rebel accounts. This is my second account, JDB Designs. I post photography, logos, patterns, and anything that I make goes on here. My main one is well, me and my dad made art. Now it's an archive store. Since he passed away, I haven't uploaded much on there. All of his work's on there. And it is is like his own art, and my art, some of them. But I need to tell you this because, like I said on YouTube, there are many channels promoting you can make three to five grand a month on Redbubble. Is it possible? Sure, but not with how they say it. The channels I'm talking about, I'm not going to name, but I'll tell you a description of them, not what they're trying to do. This one channel says that he has 10 to like 20 stores on Redbubble and he makes over 60 designs a day which that's the limit for a, a day for designs for Redbubble and he been, did this for a year okay now the reason he did this because he did an experiment which is fine but depends on the design if you're making crap designs and copying and pasting no wonder it is a bad spam problem on Redbubble because people are following his advice, doing what he's saying, and there's so much bad designs on there, it's unbelievable. But his channel has over a decent amount of subscribers, a lot of views, a lot of clickbait titles. I check his stories out, see if legit. They are, but it's a four of crap. Then the d designs are bad, a lot of spam. But he encourages you to buy his bots he made for tagging in descriptions. He sells bots to average around $9 a month to $50 a month. And it's monthly, it's not a one time cost. Then he encourages you to buy his courses. I don't know how much they are, but they're a lot of money, it seems. And what I've seen, all his reviews are pretty much fake. And all the and all the stuff he says, see, my stuff is working. People are buying it. But you go to their accounts, and they're like, they're fake accounts on the stores. So he, he's buying his own stuff, saying that he is selling a lot and making this much money. But in reality, he's not. How much I make on my stores? It depends. Some months I make nothing. Some I make maybe 20 to to $100 a month. But very not very often. And the reason I'm making this video is be careful on who you follow with Redbubble on print on stuff. Because a lot of them are lying to you. A lot of them are telling you what you want to hear just so I didn't get views and subscribers. I'm telling you the truth because I've been doing this for three years. And the reality of this, and some people will agree with me on why it's, it takes time in Redbubble. Now, if you do get success on Redbubble, with, they do have a fan art program, copyright stuff. I don't do that because I don't like doing that. If you get in that and you don't violate any terms with them, and yes, you can make decent money on here, but it's going to take time and a lot of work. But you don't have to do that. Uh, just make your own stuff. Make decent designs. Don't make crap designs. Don't tag spam. You know, a lot of people do that too. That's why you see rank, rank the ones that are ranked first all tag spamming. Probably was a bad issue with that. But I do encourage you to post your designs on multiple platforms. On T Public, Zazzle, Society6, Cafe Press. And Merch Brand is on if you get approved because they have an approval on there. I'm not approved. I can't get on there. So do the free ones. Do what you can. It takes a lot of time. Don't be surprised if you don't make anything for a few months. It's just how it is on this my bubble fixes that's pro that's problem. But this is a short video, 
If you have any questions, comments, please put in the, in the comments and I'll happily answer them best that I can. And just decide what you want. Don't follow the trends because trends don't last very long. Some of them work, some don't. But create what you want to create. And yeah, people don't like it, but some some will. You'd be surprised. So have a have a great day.